What's up YouTube, this is Prince with ATP 101 and in this video I'm going to show you guys how to downgrade from 11.2 to 11.1.2 or 11.1.1 to prepare for a jailbreak. Basically Ian Beer just said he's going to release his kernel exploit so anybody who's interested could use it to create a jailbreak. And also Luca Tedesco, he also said that his KPP bypass used in the 10.x jailbreak is still open on the newer firmware because Apple will need to set up set, basically put out new hardware to fix it. Software can't fix his KPP bypass. It could fix some of it but the main parts are still there. So that's real good news. So if you guys want to be, be prepared for iOS 11.x jailbreak or that's 11.1.2 then this is how you downgrade to 11.1.2 if you're interested in a jailbreak. Me uh, I'm not getting my hopes up, but just to be safe, it's cool to be on a firmware that can be jailbroken if a jailbreak is actually released because 10.2 patches a whole bunch of um, exploit use that they had and all that kind of stuff. So, yeah, so this is how you downgrade from 11.2 to 11.1.2. So, okay, plug in your phone and iTunes is open you can see I'm on 11.2 let me show you guys that on my phone so if we're about I could just show you right there check for software update you tell you that I'm on 11.2 so you're gonna need to download the IPA so you wanna go to IPA IPSW me and you wanna click on your phone I have the iPhone 10 so I'll click right here then I'll click right here and then if it's in green that's basically all the firmware that's let me focus a little bit if it's in green this is all the firmware that Apple is signing right now so you could downgrade to 11.1.2 or 11.1.1 I'm going to 11.1.2 so you just click on it then you would hit download but if you have another phone like the iPhone you can see all these firmers have been signed. Click on it, then you hit download. I already got mine downloaded and saved to the desktop. So when you go here, your phone plugged in, you just want to hit check for update. So you want to hit on a Windows computer, you want to hit shift and then check for update. On a Mac, you want to hit options, then click check for update, and then you're going to search for your IPSW which mine is right here iPhone 10 that's it right here 11.1.2 click open and with this method when you hit shift check for update you won't lose any of the information on your phone everything will be there your emails your messages your pictures everything will be there only thing is the firmware is going to change because this is an update manner not the restore if you did a restore to that firmware then every you would lose everything but if you hit update everything will be there so hit update right there see it says extracting software up top remember your phone got to be plugged in and it's also good to be on the latest version of iTunes that was asking me to put in my passcode so if your phone lock while it's doing it just put in your passcode and it should continue So there it is. It says your iPhone has been updated. Hit OK. Your phone should reboot. And then you'll be good to go. Back on 11.1.2 or 11.1.1, whichever firmware you want to downgrade to. So let the phone boot up. You can see it's on a new firmware because it's already telling me 11.2 is available for me to update to. I want to show again. Should I hit download? Yeah, I'm going to hit download only. So let that download. Let that download for now. And this is the iPhone 10. 
wrapped in a D brand skin. You click in the right corner to watch that at the end of the video. Come on, come on, come on. So there you go. See, I still have my same lock screen that I had from before. Let's go ahead and unplug this. Unlock it. I gotta use my passcode because so everything, all my apps are still there. Everything, all my emails just came back. Everything is still there. Only thing is that I'm gonna be on iOS 11.1.2, just like that. So if I go to not now, if I go to check for a software update. It should tell me, boom. 11.2 beta 6 because I'm in the beta program 11.2 beta 6 is there so yeah that's how you downgrade from iOS 11.2 down to 11.1.2 if you want to get ready for the iOS 11 jailbreak it's Prince with ATP 101 rate comment definitely subscribe peace thanks for watching